In this AutoCAD tutorial, I want to talk about um, extracting edges and how you can use that for other functions like maybe a sweep or something like that. So what I have on the screen right now is just a simple surface made from an extruded spline. So if I switch one of my views here to conceptual, you'll see that um, I have this very simple surface made here, kind of like bent metal or something like that. Um, and it's just made from a very simple spline that was then uh, extruded. Okay, so uh, we can see that in 3D over here on the right and in 2D in a right orthographic view um, over here on the left side of the screen. So uh, one of the important things with um, you know once you've extruded or something like that uh, with these types of 3D objects is that the the lines used to create them kind of disappear and if we wanted to uh, you know do some more work to this uh, you know such as using a sweep or something those become really important and are a problem if they're gone you can very simply find them again though and that's really nice to know if we go to the home tab what we can do is find in that solid editing section, uh, which you might not think to look for, but there's a function called extract edges, which can be used on um, solids, surfaces, meshes, and so on. So I'm going to extract edges, select the surface that I've made, and hit enter. When I do that, you'll see that now I actually have edges that I can click on and work with. Okay, so now that I have that, what I might want to do is do some sort of sweep or, you know, that type of thing. So I might just switch from a right to a top view and give myself a few different things to work with. I'm actually going to go to the surface tab and grab my spline and I might just do, you know, a very simple little curve and maybe just you see and do a real small circle. So what we'll have here when we're done with the sweep is either a solid or a surface sweep. Either would work. So you can use them, you know, very interchangeably. Okay. So in my 3D isometric view, what I'm going to do is go to sweep and then I can select this little line that I made. Enter and then the new edge that I would like it to sweep along and there you can see it's actually put it in place and then I could do the same thing on the other side and we'll have a solid so I'll do sweep select the circle enter and I'll put it over on this side All right so once I have that I'm just gonna put this in a conceptual view and orbit around so you can see the difference. So on the left where I use that curve, we did a sweep and we have that curve running along and it's a surface. And on the right, we have a solid because it was a closed shape. So really the difference is up to you how you want to do it. Um, but the important thing here was finding the edges so that we were then able to move on to use a different tool. Otherwise, those aren't going to work because you're not going to be able to find the line that Cat's looking for.